let anyone hurt you again. You don't have to be afraid anymore, okay? Because you're safe. Kate, Connie, it doesn't matter to me. You gotta just come back to me, you know? Do you want to come back to me? Sonny. What are you doing? Don't, don't, don't disappear, Kate. Just stay with me, okay? Stay. Dad, Dad, what is going on? Get back, get out of here. Get out of here. Dad, what are you doing? I'll let you tell him. Sonny, good question. Tell him! Tell him how you snatched me up and threw me into a car, tied me to a chair like an animal! I think we both like to know the answer to that one. Is that true? Have you been keeping her here? For days. Yeah, it's true. Why? Because I, I thought that if I could get Connie alone, I could wear her down a little bit and bring Kate back. By kidnapping her. What was I supposed to do, Mike? Not this, Dad. Well, the legal system's worthless. They won't let me get treatment for Kate, so I had to do it myself. Wait, this is crazy. You're not a psychiatrist. Touché. Well, I, that's why I brought somebody in. That was the whole plan, but he couldn't take it, and he left. Is he a wuss? Come here. I was getting real close. I was right there. She was on the verge of coming back. I could see it in her eyes. Yeah, and then you got here in the nick of time, Mikey. I was just wishing that my knight in shining armor would come in, and you fit the description quite well. So why don't you be a good boy and call the cops for me? My, my son's right? not calling the cops. You sure about that? Ellie, here, let me understand this. You want to have me arrested? Because I'm helping Kate? This isn't help, Dad. This is kidnapping. College is uh, looking good on you, Mikey. I love her, Michael. I know okay, you do. We're supposed to be married right now, starting a and new instead, life. Instead, you're dealing with this. It's not fair. Okay, I know. I'm glad you understand. Let me finish. I understand why you hate Connie, okay? I do, too. Oh, thanks. But you can't always use force to get what you want. It might have worked with AJ. That doesn't mean why, you can always why do... Why are we talking about AJ Because you right made now. him give me up by using threats and violence. The same thing you're doing with Connie There's right no now. There's no comparison. The situation's different, Michael. AJ always told me this was your M.O. AJ, well, hold on, what? AJ told you? AJ told you? Huh? Like you haven't grown up with me? You didn't, you didn't live in, in my house calling me dad? You're doing exactly what I told you not to do. You're letting AJ fill your head with garbage. Dad, I think he's right. Yeah? You think he's right? Call cops. Go ahead. Turn me in. Mikey. Give your dad what he deserves. A tiny cell with the big roommate. Shut your mouth about prison with him. Oh, touchy, touchy. Dad, I'm not calling the cops. Come on! The mom did that to me when I begged her not to. I'm not going to turn around and do the same thing to you. Thank you, Michael. But this ends now. Let her go. Yeah, do you hear that, sunny boy? The party's over. Dad, just let her go. And you know what? You know what? After you let me go, you can hand me my phone because I'll be calling the cops myself. You were... Kate was here. I know she was. Well, is she here now? Dad, how do you think this would work? Oh, let me answer that. Your adopto dad thought one flash of his dimples would bring Kate out. I'd be gone, Kate would be back, and they'd go skipping off to the sunset. Isn't that right? Well, that's a bust, and so is you getting away with this. So let's go. I gotta get to my phone. Dad, you're hurting Kate, too. If you care about her as much as you say you do, you'll let Connie go. Then what, Michael? I don't know. You're doing the right thing, Dad. Call the cops, but you know what? You'll be sorry if you do. I'm gonna be sorry when I call the cops. <laughs> Think you got that backwards, genius? When you tell them what happened here. I'm, I swear I was just minding my own business, and you just charge in here and try to kill me. Really? Try me, Connie. Well, you know what, Sonny? I got witnesses. I got Sean. I got Max, and that rent a shrink you hired. You think they're gonna really speak against me? My reputation may not be great, but I tell you what, yours is worse. No one's gonna take your word over mine. No one. If you try this again, 
You're gone. Whatever. So close. I could I could touch it. And you walked in. Scarface, you here? Thank God. Now I can eat in peace. in Maine by Molly Lansing Davis. Get out. <laughs> Teen emo angst. Oh, just what the doctor ordered. If I just had a little more time with Connie, I'm telling you, Kate would be here right now. I mean, I was, I'm telling you. And it's, it's my fault she's not. No, I'm just telling you that I, I, that I was if, if Kate retreated or whatever you want to call it, it's not because of me, okay? It's because of what you were doing to Connie. Michael, why are we having this I'm conversation? I'm sorry, but Dad, you have no one to blame but yourself. 